have found that information changes, platforms change, and sometimes even the look in colors or in what we call content enrichment changes and could in fact give the wrong impression if you don't stay with it, if you don't watch what's going on. It's like when you're renting an apartment. You know that old deal where it says in the lease you can't paint the walls, they have to get permission from the, the landlord? Well, that's the problem that you're going to have if you do not pay real strict attention to different platforms on Facebook. Focus on your building your email list and developing your website. That can deliver you more products and service directly to your customers. Make sure you always think about that. If you're doing podcasting, it's the same thing. Make sure that you're building your email list, your actual development of your website coincides with your podcast. That way, when you post it on Facebook with a content hook that comes back to your website, it keeps the information and keeps you alive, and nobody can really change you that way. Or, shall we say, throw a wet bucket of water on a good burning uh, campfire. But, remember now, that doesn't mean I'm saying not to use Facebook. Just keep using Facebook, LinkedIn, and the other social media channels. But find the best marketing channel for you and build it so it comes back to your website. And that way, you always have your own digital property and your own digital branding. It's so important. And as it was for us on the disruptors, we have worked very hard to find the different platforms that work for us and are building drop pages uh, and other instruments now to gain popularity in our networking so people can get all of us. By the way, if you have some information you'd like to give us, or if you would like to throw a lemon or a tomato at at Candace, uh, please feel free to do so. The uh, email address is... Your Disruptors, spelled T-O-R-S, at gmail.com. That's Your Disruptors, and Disruptor is spelled with a T-O-R-S, at gmail.com. Kind of confusing, isn't it? One of our new sponsors I want to talk about real quickly today is a good, our good friends over at B&G, Sponsored Events, and they've got a big event coming up. In fact, they just finished one over this weekend. And that one was over at the Wild West VFW Hall in Tacoma. They were having their frightfully uh, delightful bazaar, bazaar going on, and it was pretty exciting over there. It was raffle tickets, shopping, and a lot of fun. Their next one coming up is to celebrate the military men and women in our armed forces. It's going to be on Veterans Day. Now write this down. It's the Red, White, and Blue Bazaar. It's going to be at the Veterans uh, Veterans Day, Saturday, November 11th. My brain is getting ahead of my mouth here. It's going to be at 10 a.m. until 4 p.m. Here's the address. Jot this down. 4634 South 74th Street in Tacoma. That's Mount Tahoma High School. All shoppers that come, by the way, they're in military uniform for that day, receive a free raffle ticket. And there's some beautiful stuff being raffled off. So that'd be very, very exciting. If you want to get more information on what's going on at this particular show, uh, contact Gail at, and let me give you the email address, B-O-K-W-O-R-M-234 at AOL.com. That's bookworm, B O O K, excuse me, B-O-K-W-O-R-M-234 at AOL.com. Now, that's a wonderful show that they're bringing up. It's going to come up. We're going to talk more about it on the on the podcast. We will be talking about it uh, in our live interview, by the way, when the disruptors decide to disrupt B&G. And that'll be exciting for us and a lot of fun. So we wanted to remind you of those shows coming up. Some other community events coming up is on the 23rd. We have got something exciting coming up. We're going to go up to the Grange on the 23rd. The Grange is having, the Fruitland Grange is having an open house. And, right. No, 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 no. The Grange, not, not, not the barn. People get confused. People get confused. The big building on up, 39th Avenue East, behind the baseball field, is not a barn. It is the Fruitland Grange. Been there for over 77 years. It's a lot of fun 
is a great place. A great community events have been held there. And what they want to do is they want to talk about the Grange, the past and the future. So they're having an open house October 23rd, 530. Come on up, have some coffee. We're going to have some Grange uh, people there from the different Grange uh, uh, locations around the Puget Sound area. And I think it'll be a lot of fun. Come on down. I'll tell you what's also going to be fun. Uh, we'll be right now uh, planning and laying out everything that we need to do to bring a podcast live at the Grange on their open house day. So you come down, throw rocks at me if you wish. I'll be there. Just make sure the rocks are made out of sponge rubber. I'll be there. We'll be talking to guests. Hey, maybe we can get you on the podcast. Who knows? It's October. Write this down now. That is October 23rd. That's coming up. It's on a Monday night, 530 open house at the Grange. Is your car running a little crap, A? Eh? Does it kind of overheat in this weather now that fall has come? You know, I in fact, I just, the other day, was over at Starbucks, and as I walked in the door, I didn't have my coat on. You know, the weather's been really nice this year, and right there in the door, big sign, it's fall again. And I was thinking to myself, wow, well, okay, it's fall again, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to you know, rejo- rejoice in this beautiful weather. I like it. But my good friend Big John over Big John's Auto Lube and Automobile Repair reminded me that this is the right time for you to get over to Big John's and have that cooling system checked out. Now, you cannot imagine the damage that can happen to your automobile if your cooling system is not, is not working properly. And make sure that your pH value of the water versus the mixture of antifreeze is correct because if it isn't even though you have antifreeze in there if our weather all of a sudden drops down and gets severely cold you could be stuck with an overheating automobile and that's not a great idea to do especially if you're alongside the road or on the freeway so i want you to do something here i want you to write this down i want you to head out to big john's it's at 1818 99th street east in tacoma now, Big John's Auto Loop, you can't miss it. It's right on the corner, right on the corner of the main drag, which I believe is Portland Avenue and 18th on the right-hand side. Big brown building, you'll see the big sign. Go on in, tell them that you heard this ad on the uh, Keep a Show Live, and get yourself a 10% discount for all your cooling service needs. That's 10% off. And that'll end at the end of the month. So, hey, you got to get in there quick. And uh, while you're there, say hello to Rhonda. Oh, Rhonda is my buddy. Rhonda is love behind a ranch. She's a wonderful person. She runs the front desk and helps out her husband, John, who's the owner and the head mechanic there. And John and Rhonda know how to do customer service and to take care of your right. So head on down there. It'll be exciting. If you need an appointment, which I really, really, truly think would be a great idea, give them a call. You know, you can call them from 9 o'clock in the morning until 5 o'clock at the night. And let me tell you what the address is. Let me find it here. John John stepped on my file last time I saw him, so I have to remove his big footprint from the card. His number at the office is 253 292 one six three nine let me give that to you one more time that's big john's auto lube and automotive it's over at two five three that's where you can call for an appointment two nine two one six three nine and if you're looking for big john and you got some questions why don't you try big john's uh oil at gmail.com you can get a hold of him big john's oil at gmail.com and uh, that's the best move you can make, it, especially with the winter coming up, man. There's nothing worse than having your car overheat. And the damage it can do, ho oh, ho, you cannot imagine. So think, think maintenance, think car care. And if you need car care done, Big John is the place to go. Big John's out of lube. Well, as I told you, she's out of town. So I got to give her a little bit of a pun and, and pun, punt. I'm going to punt the wild child right into reality as I talk to you a little bit about some of the exciting stuff that she's doing. As I mentioned to you before, we're at her classroom. Yes, she has a classroom. Isn't that exciting? 
And at her classroom, she's got some special three-hour classes coming up. And I'm just going to touch on some of the classes that are there that she's teaching because I had the great opportunity to enjoy uh, sitting in one of the classes, in fact. I found it to be, and I'm looking for the paperwork here, I found it to be really exciting. Now, I've been in business a long time, and I, you can always learn more. And at Candace's classes, understanding branding is one of the classes. Developing your processes, acceleration for your business goals, vision, statements, leadership development, creating a customer experience, understanding direct sales marketing, entrepreneurship, and much, much more. Now, these classes are unique because they're small classes. She only has 10 seats available. And it gives you the opportunity to do hands-on things. Now, you'll never experience a class like Candace's class at the Wild Child Workshop. And, uh, excuse me, and you'll never really realize how much she gives you to think about. Because when you leave, you're really inspired to go back and build your business from local to global. Now, here's how you get a hold of Candace to make sure that you can get a seat. And the best way to do this is to give her a call, 253-961-7525. That is, once again, 253-961-7525. She's always excited to talk with you. If you are a small business and need help in other directions, such as maybe building up your fast start business or for business, to build that, that business up and get it fast and getting it going if you're a new entrepreneur, also give her a call. She's got wonderful programs for the fast track. There you go. Candace, it's a really honored to work with her. I learn a lot each day, even though I often wonder what's going on. Well, folks, that's the end of the show today. I've got to step out here for just a moment. We've talked about some really great things going on. And uh, let me let me just, first of all, I got to close the barn door here so Candace doesn't get mad at me leaving the door open. Oh, there it goes. Holy smokes. The door is closed. Thank you so much for being with me today. Hope you have a great, great week coming up. And until we see you again, this is Bill reminding you to keep a smiling.